Google keeps on gathering data about us, but at least now we can limit how long it keeps it all. This tip will show you how to stop Google hanging on to your web and app history. Hello, I'm William Gallagher for Apple Insider. Here's how to make Google automatically delete data it has about you. And even if you've never cared what Google figures out, follow these steps anyway, because when you actually see what Google knows, it can be quite creepy. Start by going to the website, myaccount.google.com. Even if you've never been there in your life before, you can log straight into this because somewhere on the line, you have signed up for a Gmail or a G Suite account, something like that. Log in with those credentials and then click on data and personalization in the list to the left. This brings up a whole window full of activity controls and a privacy checkup. It might be worth looking around all of these settings sometime, but for now, there's just one that Google has updated to allow us these new deletion options. So find web and app activity and click on the arrow to the far right of it. This takes you to the first of several pages that will try to persuade you to leave well alone. Google explains here that letting it keep information about you means you get a better experience online. Click on manage activity. Just go towards the bottom of the screen where you'll see a line that says web and app activity is on. There will be a line that most likely says your activity is being kept until you delete it manually. If it says that, then click on the button right below, which will be called choose to delete automatically. You can continue to let Google keep everything forever or rather until you think to come back here to delete it manually. You can choose to have Google automatically delete the data it holds on you after 18 months, or you can have Google automatically delete your da its data about you after three months. This is why we're here. From now on, Google will automatically delete any data it holds on you to do with web and app activity after three months have expired. Click next, and this one has a confirm button. When you click that button, two things happen. The first is that as of right now, Google won't keep any new information about you for longer than three months. And the second is that right now, it will delete anything it's already got that's older than this. And after you click to confirm, you can leave the myaccount.google.com site because you're done. That's it. What do you think? Does this help you? Are you creeped out by the details Google shows of your activity? Let us know in the comments below. Hey everyone, did you guys like that video? Be sure to click on that like button so we can create content that we know that you guys want to see. And follow Apple Insider on all social media channels. If you want the best prices on any Apple gear, check out the Apple Insider price guide that is updated daily. And until next time, we'll see you later.